Right, Alex Smith, we're standing here in front of what many would know as the old Air Training Corps buildings at Omark Aerodrome in Blenheim. You are one of the committee members of the Garrison Society, um, who has taken over management of these buildings. Can you tell me a little bit about, to start with, um, who is the Garrison and, and why are you interested in these buildings? The uh, Garrison Society Inc. is uh, primarily uh, a group of individuals who have come together to look at restoring this particular facility. Um, Like-minded people who are interested in military history, um, a lot of us own military equipment, vehicles, um, gear, everything related to the military of the First World War, Second World War and um, all sorts of conflicts after that as well. So what was the original history of these buildings? Um, this was a marker air base. These buildings, particularly 1941, um, we understand they were first used, constructed, um, used as a training school, uh, primarily for uh, pilots, um, navigation. The garrison are now managers of the building. Um, what, what are your actual plans for, for restoring or, or rebuilding? We will return the building to uh, uh, an operational status. Uh, it's going to be New Zealand's only uh, operating uh, World War II building. It'll be a representation of how it was in its heyday. Um, it will uh, encompass all parts of what it would have done during its, its lifetime as an operational base. And we also hope to incorporate the ability to use it as a uh, a civil defence emergency post as well. Um, it'll have fully functioning radio gear, all the amenities, there'll be accommodation on site and our aim is to have it so it's self-sufficient so that in, in the case of a civil emergency they'd be able to utilise the facilities as well. Um, and I believe there's talk of a, of a museum wing as well? Yep, certainly. We uh, have um, multiple rooms um, to all parts of how it was operational. A museum will be included in that um, which will house a large amount of original memorabilia. So the big question is, um, how are you going to afford all of this? Well, we have uh, a fundraising project at the moment, a give a little page, um, a give a little at thegarrison.co.nz. Uh, that page primarily is um, for the restoration of this building and to um, achieve our goals of returning it to its operational status. Um, Alex, I believe that uh, when the Air Training Corps moved out uh, about 10 years ago, the building has been uh, empty. Um, if you look around, you can see some of the weatherboards are a lot worse for wear. Um, so it, it looks old, um, obviously it is. Structurally, is it sound or is there a lot of work to be done? Well, there's definitely a lot of work to be done, but structurally, yes, the bones of the building are certainly uh, up to scratch. Uh, there's a couple of south-facing walls that require some replacement of timber, framing, and definitely weatherboards, weatherboards here and there, but no, the actual internal structure of the building is very sound, and um, as you say, we've got a long road ahead of us. There's a lot of work to do on it, but it's something we're all very passionate about achieving. Now, Alex, you mentioned the Give a Little campaign, um, but the Garrison Society um, has members uh, elsewhere other than just Marlborough, is that right? Yes, that's correct. We're a New Zealand-wide organisation. We have um, uh, barracks in Canterbury, um, North Island. We have members in Australia. Um, so, yeah, it's a wide-reaching uh, organisation at the moment. And I also understand it's a very family-focused society? Oh, most certainly we have a number of children and, and families involved in the, in the garrison. Um, both of my children uh, are actively involved. Um, they dress up in period uh, evacuee costumes and so forth for, for events. Right, so uh, anybody wanting more information on either the, the buildings and the restoration of that or in fact joining and supporting the garrison should just take a look at the webpage, I see. Yes. Yes, most definitely. www.thegarrison.co.nz Great. Alex, thank you very much. Thank you.